Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video, and today, I know it's not going to be a long upload, but I kind of figured it is an uploading day, so I figured I'd come out here and show you guys what I've done today. Now, I've been saying, I've been hopping it up and trying to get it hopped up and showed you a tent review last video about uh, how I'm going to start making camping videos and stuff. Well, I went out and made me a little bit of a campsite today. It's nothing, nothing too much, since it's just going to be me out here. Um... Try to plan it out a little bit smart, and I put a creek in the background. Well, I didn't put one there. It was there. That's why I put the campsite in the creek in the background. But uh, just in case I do run out of bottled water, I am going to boil some of that that I got and back here in the creek. If it's not dried out, hopefully in the summer. So um, I'm going to go ahead and show you what it is. I'm going to walk out of the woods right here. Right here is kind of the little entrance, but uh, I don't know what's going on here. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and show you the entrance. My dog started barking because my neighbor came home. But, um... First, what you do is you walk down this hill right there's my house. You walk down the hill. He's walking again. And you come in right here. You don't really see nothing here. You see maybe a little rock pile right there. But you come in through the woods right here. You walk in. You got this little fire pit. With a chair over there. Nothing really special about the fire pit. Just a circle of rocks. And I got all that wood over there that I can burn. And all those thorns and... It's in the woods, you know, you have a lot to burn. Uh, anyway, there's the fire pit, pretty good size. Hopefully big enough for me. And back, which well, isn't going to be big enough, but back here, you can kind of see how I scrape the, uh, the leaves back. This is where I plan on putting the tent. I may actually go up and get it in a little while after this video and uh, try to set it up and see how good it's going to look in here and see how it's all going to work out because some of this is a little uneven, more uneven than I'd like it to be, but... You know, you just got to kind of fill it with it. I was trying to kick that around right there and make that a little flatter because it was a little bumpy and stuff back here. Back here is a creek I was talking about. Nothing really special. Just a little creek that we have back behind the house that runs and follows that whole entire four-wheeler trail that goes back there. And, yeah, I got a little bit of a deep spot right there. Maybe I can get water in a little canteen or something. The bad thing is it's quicksand mud kind of stuff, which is... Not that good, but it's not too far away from the campsite. Something was touching my head. But right there would be the tent somewhere around in that area, and you just walk back here, and there's the. That's in case I ever run out of water during the camping video. So, like I said, tent right here, fire pit back here. I may have one of my friends come out, and I may have to put another chair right through here somewhere, or something like that. But um, as of right now, it's working out pretty fine. I gotta move this right here. Okay. As of right now, it's working out pretty fine. It's set up exactly how I want it. It's working out really well. Um, hopefully, the camping video will be up sometime this week. I don't know. I'll have to um, plan it out because uh, I don't know how the weather's going to be. And I don't really want to be cold out here because it's not a all four season tent. So, that's what the bad thing is going to be. But, uh, hopefully, that will be big enough for a fire. I mean, I'm sure it will be. But, you know... Uh, I can't really tell you how comparison that size is, well, what the comparison size is, because I don't really have nothing to compare it to, but the bad thing is that I'm thinking about doing is I may move it back just a little bit more, because as you can tell, the wood, or the, my yard is literally right here, here, not here, it's right here, there we go, and uh, all that good stuff, so, I don't know, it just kind of depends on how it all works out, and that stuff, but I think it's going to work out very well, hopefully. I still don't know if I'm going to walk in on that side of the tree or this side of the tree. I don't know. That's not a really important question to ask, but right there is a campsite where the tent camp's going to be. Now, I don't really know what this was. I don't know if it was like some kind of wire just to block something out or what, but it was actually strapped around this tree and it was running against that pole right there. I want to think it may have been one of those um, electric wires because my aunt used to live in the trailer that we live in now. And, uh, she had dogs and she wanted to keep them in. I don't really know what it was, but, uh, that could be what that is. I don't know. And then also something back here, or is it up there? No, it was around here. There's just a random wire just standing here. So, just sitting here. I don't really know what that goes to. So. Yeah, so, um, that's going to be the video for today. I know it's not much. You guys are going to kind of have to forgive me. I went to Brody's earlier today. And uh, actually, I spent the night last night and went in there and came back home today. I didn't want to record anything there because uh, I'm wanting to kind of get out of the vlogging just a little bit and try to do camping videos and stuff. So that's how that's going to work out. I may even dam this up a little bit and make a little bit of a water spill. 
I don't know. I may think about that, but then again, that's, that's a little bit of a deeper hole. I don't know. I have to think about it and just kind of see how everything works out. So, um, that's going to be that. I really don't know what all else I'm going to do uh, to this little area, but as, I'm for, as for right now, then this is going to be where I'm going to start setting up the tent and coming out here and making videos for you guys. Uh, maybe I can start doing something different every time I'm here. I don't really know. You guys have to give me ideas and let me know if you like it or not because I don't really know what to film here so um, I'm gonna set up the tent one day maybe today I'm not really for sure it just kinda depends if I really feel like getting it out or not because getting it out and just taking it back down is not really that fond of me for some reason uh, I might be able to, able to set the camera up right there actually I'm wait, I'm needing like I've seen videos of people and they're camping and they always have like a bigger tripod and you see my tripod is literally that big that's what my tripod is that I record with every time. You can even see it in the shadow of the last video. It's just a little gorilla pod kind of tripod thingy. It bends and all that good stuff. But if I'm wanting to set it down on the ground, then it gets weird angles. And it just don't look that well. So maybe I can set it up on the different. Maybe I can make a tripod or a stand or something. I don't really know. Just have to wait and see. So um, I'm pretty hopped for this videos. So I'm going to start making them and all that good stuff. And... Uh, actually start making them so here is an overall view of what the campsite looks like there's a little fire pit and then back in that area right through there will be the tent and stuff i'm actually thinking about going ahead and setting it up in this video now that i think about it i still got a little bit of time before this video goes up this video is being recorded or being recorded current day uh yeah i'll go ahead and set the tent up and see how it looks because it may not fit in that little area, which I'm about 100% sure that it will. And I still need to kind of figure out where I'm going to put the front with well, a door. And I'm going to put the back. So I'm going to go get the tent real quick, and I'll see how it fits in there and stuff. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do it before I talk myself out of it. Let's go get the tent. Well, you guys remember the mansion, don't you? The big old mansion of a tent that I got. I'm going to snap my fingers, and the tent shall be up. You ready? Shabam! That's how magic works. Uh, so I got the tent with the tent set up now. It's uh, honestly over that way a little bit more than I'd like it. I'd like it to be over just a little bit more on the door, kind of facing between those two trees right there, or that pipe, or that whatever fence post, and that little tree right there. Uh, which I might be able to kind of just take take the stakes out and just kind of switch it around a little bit but that's what it's going to look like here's what it looks like from a distance in case you wondered now it looks more like a campsite because you got the tent and the fire pit and the little chair back there camera's not focusing as always but uh that's going to be the little tent that's the tent that's going to be set up that i'm going to be sleeping in uh waterproofed it just a little bit hopefully that's good i need to make a little bit more flat points over here because uh well the back is not completely stretched out the way that I wanted it to, and this side's completely off of the ground, and I'm just going to have to work with it right now. I'll, I'll try to fix it in just a second. Take my little kitty boots off, that way I can actually set it in here. It's, ironically, they match the tent, but there is something hard right there. I'm not really sure what that is, but uh, that's what it looks like from the outside looking at, or from the inside looking out. Um, I believe this is going to work out really well. It is a little bit wrinkly in here, but I believe I need to stretch it out just a little bit more and get it flat, but I don't really know. This is working out a lot better than I had planned it to. we got the fire pit sitting right over there, a nice chair, the house in the back with the front, and uh, my, my booties that match the color scheme of a tent, neon green and, and black. That's, that's perfect. Now I'm completely in the tent. Got a little window up here that... I didn't put the rain fly on because I'm just going to take it down immediately after I get it. There's a little window that I have for the front. It gives me a little thing that I can uh, loop it on right here and stuff. I can get this underneath here and just kind of tie it and just hold it back. That is if I want to. But yeah, this is probably going to go ahead and end the video. I know it wasn't long. I don't think, I don't, I've not really edited this yet, I'm still recording, but, uh, that's my little campsite, guys, uh, I, I really look forward to making videos like this and all that good stuff, 
I'm extremely excited to see how far this will go and how good it's going to be. I don't know why I wouldn't point the camera toward me. Uh, just for how the day's going, I guess. But, uh, yeah, so that's going to go ahead and wrap up the video. Um, I may have made a new intro. That's possible. So if you guys want to see that, here is what that looks like before I end the video. So there's the new intro. I'm still kind of iffy if I like it or not. I've not really completely watched it all the way through until now. But, uh, I made it last night when I was at Brody's and I just kind of figured I needed a new intro. Go ahead and take off vlogs off my YouTube channel. And that way it's just Isaiah Sexton now. So, um, that way I can pretty much upload gaming videos, camping videos, whether I want to do a vlog or not. I'll just go ahead and upload anything to the channel that I want to. But without further ado, guys, I'm going to go ahead and cut the video off here. I know it's not much. It's just me showing around and stuff. But, uh, I'm going to go... There's a hair right there. Got it. I'm going to go ahead and cut the video off. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, it means the world to me. I see at least just eight views or so on here. Um... I know it's not a lot, but it's better than nothing. I keep on trying to tell myself that, but we're growing, guys. We're growing. So that makes me happy. It makes me feel better. So until next time, guys, thank you for watching. Make sure you comment. Make sure you are subscribed before you get out of the channel so uh, you can keep on watching the videos if you like them. But anyway, I will see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching. You guys know the drill, and roll the outro.